welcome back to Texas Mommy. My name is Amanda, if you've never seen me before, and today I was gonna be going over with you my top 10 favorite baby names that I would not be using. So if you'd like to see that, just continue watching. Okay, so to get right into the video, I have my top 10 baby names. So I have five boys' names and five girls' names that I love but will not be using for my children. So let's get right on into it. We're gonna start off with the girls, no favoritism, just starting off with the girls. So it's not in any particular order, these are just my top five favorite baby names. So first off, we do have Alice, um, which actually this is a favorite baby name of mine because it is actually my mother's middle name. So that name does, you know, hold dear to me, but I will not be using this name for my children. So to continue on, we have Lucinda, which is actually my middle name, which was actually my grandmother's first name. So as you can tell, duh, that's why I love the name is Lucinda. The next one would be Charlotte. I've always thought that Charlotte was a very beautiful name, whether the little girl is very small or is already grown into a woman, it's just a very beautiful name to have. After that would be Adeline. I just love Adeline. It just seems like one of those very um, fragile names, Adeline. It just sounds so beautiful, almost like a flower, just something that would be so gorgeous to look at. But the last name that I have on here is Anastasia. And anyone that knows me or my family knows that we have always loved the name Anastasia. I actually have a niece whose middle name is Anastasia. Um, and we actually just fell in love with this name after watching Anastasia. Duh, I know, that should have been common sense, right? Okay, so to go into the boys' names, we're gonna go with the top five I have listed. And again, they're in no special order, so here we go. The first one on here would be Luke. That is just a real good name. Um, if you've ever watched Gilmore Girls, you'll know where we got Luke from. I just automatically you think Luke, you think Gilmore Girls if you ever watched it. So to continue on, we have Dean. Because again, we're staying with the Gilmore Girl theme. So to continue on, we have Jeremiah. And I just really love the name Jeremiah. It just sounds like a very strong name um, for a strong young man, whether he's at a young man phase or an adult phase. Jeremiah just is a very good name. And it is also a biblical name. Um, so if, if any of those that are watching this are looking for a biblical name, Jeremiah is a biblical name um, that you could always give your son. So to continue on with that, we have Timothy, um, which is also a biblical name as well. And Timothy is just a very, you know, it's a very strong name. It's a very nice name to have. I actually do have a dear friend of mine whose name is Timothy. And he just fits the name perfectly because he is so sweet and nice and lovely. So my last name for boys is Alexander. And anyone that personally knows me knows how much I love the name Alexander. It's just always been one of my favorite names. When I was a little girl, I've always loved this name, Alexander. Not to say I don't like the other four I gave you, but just Alexander is one of those ones that, oh my goodness, I think I just, I'm absolutely in love with the name. So like I said, those are my top 10 baby names, five boys, five girls. And if you'd like to see another one of these videos, don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up. And if there's any baby names that you like that I didn't mention, go ahead and leave them down in the comment section below. That way, you know, it might give somebody else an idea who's looking for baby names for their baby. So hope you enjoyed the video. Can't wait to see you next time.